everyone, this is Carolyn, and you are watching Hollywood First Look Features, and today I am so happy to have Chris and Annabelle here from the movie Fat Camp. You guys, this was a lot of fun. Tell me a little bit about the movie. Well, the movie is about my character Hutch. He gets kicked out because he's a piece of shit. And, <laughs> and he has to go to his uncle's fat camp. Uh, where he actually used to attend cause he used to be fat so he has these body issues and he gives a lot of the kids uh, a lot of grief uh, for uh, being fat because of his own insecurities and he sees uh, Annabelle's character and uh, doesn't recognize her from back in their childhood and through a series of him going through ups and downs he learns that he needs to be a better person to people and uh, it's just a story about acceptance I want your little baby bodies I need to lose weight I'm a freaking stud! Why are you just like that? Got a hot date? Can we smell your fingers later? Who is that? That's, uh, that's Abby Kripa. She's cute if you're into that type of thing. Everybody's into that type of thing. How fun was it for you guys to play both Hutch and, and Abby? So much fun. I mean, there's not a day on set that felt like work. Working with these kids was amazing. I mean, they're just confident. They're crazy and wild and um, yeah, we had, we had a lot of fun. Well, I heard that Jennifer, the director, really decided that she wanted to use actual kids in this movie. Didn't hire adults to play teenagers, but these were actual kids. Yeah. What was that like for you guys? And how was that, I mean, you know, it's fat camp. It, 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 being that age is hard and, and being overweight. What was that experience like? They're, you know, they're very special. They're very special kids. They they work hard and, and they're fearless. And, you know, they would just say the craziest things. Me and him would be like, what? And, you know, some days were a little bit challenging to get through because, you know, they're kids. So they just, you know, they lose their attention span and they want to go play. And it's like, no, we're still shooting. You know, so it was a little bit frustrating at times, but it was, it was, it was fun. Your director, Jennifer, is known for working on very serious documentaries and then she's taken this turn into fat camp which is a lot of fun what was that experience like working with her uh jen jen was awesome man she kept us she knew how to get serious when she needed to which we needed because uh i like the kids would go crazy and i'd go crazy too and it'd be hot you know what i mean and so uh and i, I like to egg on the kids sometimes because i'm like that fun uncle that knows that i don't have to stay with the kids all day but that, I mean, that experience, were you guys actually filming on an actual camp? It, that, that's, yeah, what it, yeah. that's what it looked like. And what time of year was, was this? Was this actually like during the summer? It, it was, it was, uh, it was like the springtime, right? Like, it was hot. yeah, it, it was, it was hot, but then it, it, it would get cool at night. Um, but it, it was in Malibu at an actual fitness camp. So there was like fitness uh, camps going on while we were filming, which was also a little crazy. And, uh, and weird. So it was an actual fitness camp. So in a way yeah. that you guys were really kind of immersed in that. In yeah. A way. Yeah. And I, and I had a room on, on the fitness camp because it was easier than like traveling back and forth. So uh, I was just in it all the time. But it was, it was amazing to work there because they had like heated pools and like it was just pretty dope. So you guys were actually at camp and working at the same time. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> so, you know, when you guys were delving into these characters, I mean, not to, you know, that both of them were struggling as kids, you know, working through, you know, becoming these, you know, fit adults. Were there any sorts of, like, experiences in your personal life that you guys had to overcome challenges like that? I mean, as a kid, I wanted to be taller, you know? I, I, I did. I, I wanted to be... I, I Well, I know it's not, you know? But I'm just, I'm just telling y'all what my issues were. <laughs> Like, I wanted my nose to be slimmer, you know what I mean? I wanted to be, like, taller. And then I saw Michael Jackson, and I was like, I'm good. And and then, you know, you, you stop growing. But as far as, like, uh, like being big, like, I, I have all type of body types in my family, and everybody's super comfortable and very confident. You know what I'm saying? So I had a lot of those examples growing up. So I, I never really had uh, had th those issues. But, I had, you know, we all have our other issues. I'll let uh, Annabelle take it away. How about you, Annabelle? <laughs> um, I love to eat, so I do, and you know, Hollywood likes me skinny, and it just goes against my DNA, so it makes um, my job challenging, because I, before I, I became an actress, you know, it's like, I'm Hispanic, we like rice and beans and plantains and steak and chicken and dessert, and you know, I love dessert, I can eat dessert as my main course, but anyway. 
Um, yeah, I actually lost a couple roles, you know, years, years ago, because, you know, I had hips, and I was just a thicker, curvier girl. Um, yeah, and I just had to, like, not eat for a while. <laughs> I starved. Yeah, right. like, I had to not eat. Like, I mean, you ate. No, I just, you know, I had to, um, I did deal with, with the pressures, you know, in, in Hollywood, especially for women, it's like you, you have to look a certain way. And um, I did deal with the pressure of that, of, you know, just having to look a, a specific way on camera, especially, you know, I love doing action stuff, and you have to be in good shape for that. My camp, my rules. My hell. Your body issues put my campers to shame. I smell booze. Yeah. Stop using all your body. It's a two step with your feet. Let's go to the mountain top. We're gonna celebrate. Living a life. We're gonna glad. We're gonna ride. We're gonna fly through the night. I can't do two people's jobs, Hutch. I'm one person. What about on the airplanes? <laughs>